up everyone it is your girl Victoria and welcome back to my channel if you're new here go ahead and click that subscribe button along with the bell button down below so you get first notifications on whenever I post so in today's video I am going to be doing a toward haul again your girl just got a new job so I needed to update my wardrobe and what I really like about what I've purchased is I'm able to take these clothes from a nine to five look to a going out look Hopefully you guys enjoy what you see. Don't forget to hit that big thumbs up button and make sure to share this with all your friends and family. Bye. So first we're going to start off with some denim pants that I purchased for casual Friday. I really love towards pants because they are super stretchy and very comfortable. Now these that you all are seeing are kind of a medium to dark wash and I love the fact they are boot cut. Now boot cut pants are my favorite types of jeans and I just thought these were really nice and cute on me and very comfortable because like I said, Tort has a lot of stretch when it comes to their jeans. So the second pair of jeans I purchased are these light wash uh, skinny, skinny jeans with a little distress on the knees. Again, very stretchy and what I usually, not usually, and what I also like about these jeans is I'm not a big fan of the whole distressed look and even though these are distressed they only have them at the knees so I can work with that and like I said these are great too because I can also wear boots with these now that we're in the fall time. Also sometimes on casual Fridays I may want to wear some overalls and that is what I got. These are the Torrid overall crops so they are not full length jeans they are cropped jeans and I again love the stretch to this and I'm glad overalls came back too because they're just like jumpsuits it's just a one and done piece and sometimes your girl is just lazy to figure out a top or a bottom. Next item we have is this plaid pink and black skirt that's also a pleated skirt. Now what I do like about this is the fact that number one the clueless look is definitely coming back so it's definitely more plaid and I also like the fact how Torrid included elastic around the back part of the jeans. It has a back zipper this I believe falls on this I believe is knee length to me you guys will see it right beside me and I really do like the color of it the flow of it and when it's usually around fall time I am a big fan of plaid so this was definitely something that needed to go in my closet so you guys know it would not be a haul if I didn't have anything leopard print. Now this is a gray and I want to say maybe like a blush pink leopard baby doll dress. Uh, the color is a little on the drab side but that's okay. I can still work with it and um, I really love the flow of it, the length of it and just the whole overall look. Um, this will be great too because sometimes I could just wear it with some stockings or even just have it in the closet for summer next year. You know, I really love the flow of this dress and just the whole look. Here we have this emerald green color shirt. I love the color emerald green on me. Now, as you guys can see in the front of it, it does have a zipper going down kind of mid chest and then it has a drawstring in the middle to help cinch in the waist. Now what I do like about this is I can dress this up or dress this down so I can either wear leggings with it or I can wear jeans and tennis shoes and be very comfortable. The arm is about elbow length for me and it does have a little button design on the side. I really do like it. The fabric is very soft and so this next piece I'm going to show you is actually a set. Now if you're not familiar with Torrid you are going to have to purchase the top and the bottom at separate prices and that is a good thing for me because I you know sometimes may need to size up or size down so I'm really liking the fact how companies are doing that. 
So starting with the skirt, which is more on the pencil skirt side, um, it's just red denim. I really like that. It hits me right at the knee. Now, like I said, that is it's a good reason that stores do allow you to purchase at different sizes because I needed to size up on the skirt because I do have big hips and thighs so I needed a little wiggle room just for me to have this on and I have the matching denim jacket now the denim jacket I also had to go up on my size too because the sleeves were a little too short for me on the original size that would have fit me and I usually like to cover my whole arm when I do have a denim outfit on and I love me in the color red so this is towards plum super soft knit I really like this and it's really weird as somebody who does love the color purple I don't wear a whole lot of purple so when I saw this I thought it looked nice and then we do have some ruching to the side along with some pleats and it is a asymmetrical shirt now i normally don't go for shirts with the points on the side i don't know why designers always think we as big girls want to wear that all the time but i like the fact this is just an asymmetrical thing i can work with that you know and if i don't like it i can always just pay somebody to just fix it for me but when i try so here we have a blazer as you guys can see it's kind of on the peplumy side um i do like this because you know i first of all i didn't need a blazer for work and i like the fact that the sides stop at the elbow and we have a little bit of a scrunch on the side and i actually do like that because i do not like you know your typical uh traditional blazer where it stops directly at the wrist i'm just not feeling that look so once i saw this you know i love the fact how it cinches in at the waist and kind of gives me more of an hourglassy shape so i really like this again another piece i can wear to work and then you know dress it down make it casual and that would be a really nice weekend look when i'm so here we have a regular halter top from torrid i like this just because i think every girl needs a halter top in her closet the only thing is i am going to have to get the back part uh sewn in a little bit for me because it was a little too long but i actually like this it's a basic and like i said every girl needs a basic and also we have this burgundy plaid kimono duster i love how it just flows on my body again very soft torrid has really stepped up when it came to their design section and i'm glad they're starting to listen to their customers more about what we want to see out here now what i am going to do with this is i'm just going to have a clasp sewn on in the middle maybe around where my bust is just to help close it a little bit because sometimes i don't want it opened all the time but i really love this i can wear this together you know with either regular denim or even black denim just to kind of allow this to be the big staple piece we have the last item from Torrid. It is this gorgeous jacket. I love the fact it is Victorian style and this is kind of one of my major pieces. Now as you guys can see it is a double breasted jacket. The only thing I wish Torrid did was instead of putting black with black buttons on it I wish they did like maybe gold buttons or silver buttons. But other than that I can't complain. Now it does have little flaps in the back and i just like the fact of how it flows and i have a tie to help cinch in at the waist to give me more of a hourglass shape and funny thing about this is i was actually on a girls trip uh to ocean city not too long ago and when i originally saw it the store out there did not have it in my size and i just went to a different tour and my mother saw it and she thought i liked it but 
you know and when she showed it to me I was like mom that's the jacket I was looking for so this jacket was meant to be mine and I'm glad I picked it up so if you all want your own I will make sure to leave a link in the description box well, I said this, this was a torrid haul but I wanted to show you all an outfit that I saw on the display window at Ashley Stewart's I really love this so I just needed to share with you all and as you guys can see first of all we're gonna start it's a plain white shirt nothing spectacular but this actually goes under the main outfit which is this black and red plaid two-piece suit now the top part is first of all more of a sweetheart neckline and on top of that it is a tube top now what I really just don't like about it is the fact that they do have pocket flaps but there are no pockets in the front. I am so sorry ladies. Yes, I know some of us do like our pockets. And the bottoms are the matching pair of pants. Now these are straight legs and again I'm not a real big fan of straight legs but I can work with that by wearing some booties with this. And the back part, they do have pocket slips, but unfortunately, these are not real pockets. Again, ladies, I know I need pockets when it comes to my outfits, but I really love this outfit. I just think it's so professional enough for work. I can even wear it on the weekends when I'm going out. So again, if I can, I will leave the links in the description box below. So that is the end of this haul i hope you guys enjoyed what you all saw maybe you all can check out your own torrid or ashley stewart nearby and might i also say this i didn't pick up a whole lot of things from ashley stewart that was the only outfit but from what i've seen they are definitely trying to step their game up when it comes to the plus size fashion that they do have uh, again, don't forget to click that subscribe button along with the bell button down below so you get first notifications on whenever I post. Thank you all so much for the love and support and stopping by watching all the videos. I really do appreciate it and I will see you all again soon. Bye!